Hey guys, what's going on and welcome to day 9 of 22 days of lipstick and for today's video I am going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the Miss Claire Matte Power Lip Color. Now I have with me 8 shades as always check out the description box below to see the shade names and for foundation shade reference I'm NC40 in MAC. Now if you have not already then do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so don't forget whenever I upload and now let's jump right on the video. So first and foremost, let's start with the description and the features of this lip color. Now it says that it is a highly pigmented liquid lipstick that sets to a flawless matte finish. It is a lightweight formula that offers full coverage in less product, packed with liquefied pigment for intense color payoff, non-sticky texture that gives long and comfortable wear. It comes with a doe foot applicator for precise application. Now this is priced at 395 rupees for 3 ml of product and they offer about 14 shades now this is how the packaging looks like which is almost in a clear tube and you have the shade number at the bottom and this is how the doe foot applicator looks like and now let's move on to the lip swatches Alright, so I hope you guys enjoy the lip swatch and now let's talk about the formula, the pros and the cons. The first pro is that these are extremely comfortable and very lightweight on the lips once it's applied and it is very quick drying as well. Like it literally takes like 10 seconds for it to dry down and it dries down to a nice matte 
finish now these are extremely pigmented as well so even the darker shades are super pigmented and just one layer or one stroke you get the full pigmentation these are transfer proof like for example clean hands almost nothing and these are non-sticky as well which is a huge pro in my opinion now the texture of this liquid lipstick is like a very thin moussey kind of a texture and it reminds me of the nyx lip lingerie as well like kind of the texture alone not the rest of the properties but just the texture of the liquid lipstick if that makes sense now for the longevity of these liquid lipstick they do last for like a maximum of five five and a half hours or probably like six hours max but then this is a kind of formula like if you have a heavy meal it will completely fade off if it is a nude shade but then if it's a darker shade this is how it will look like and as you guys can see if you do press your lips together you are good to go because it will be like a watered down version of the original shade if that makes sense and last but not the least is the price point which is not that bad it's less than 400 rupees and such a great formula so that's the last pro okay so i wanted to mention like a quick fii now this is not a con in my personal opinion or for me it's not a con but i just want to put it out there is the pricing for the quantity now when i looked at the other lipsticks that are there out in the market for a similar price point the quantity of those are much more higher than these for example, the Maybelline Sensational Liquid Lipstick, I'll put the picture right here, they are priced at 349 rupees for 7 ml of product, wherein the Miss Claire one is priced at 395 rupees for 3 ml of product. So, you see? Another example is the Lakme Forever Matte Liquid Lipstick, which looks like this. Uh, this has a quantity of 5.6 ml and it's priced at 295 rupees. So, of course, the formula and everything is completely different in all three of them. Uh, but yeah, I'm just, that's why I said, like, I'm just putting like an FYI. I'm just like putting it out there for you guys. But having said that, I still find these liquid lipstick to be extremely good quality when it comes to the formula. For me, the comfort of a liquid lipstick is much more higher than the pricing for me personally. So for me, $3.95 is not such a bad deal at all for the formula that you get for the comfort that you get so yeah i do love these liquid lipstick i do recommend them and uh, these actually do not have any cons which is very surprising so yeah these were my thoughts and opinion about the miss claire matte power lip color and this wraps up today's video you guys i hope you all enjoyed it if you did do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever i upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests i will try my best to do it for you as well as follow me on my socials which is it's a on instagram and it's a on twitter as well so until the next time take care bye